Hi, I'm Frank Paris. Uh, I have built uh, over the last three or four years, just for putting my phone down, sorry. I built in the last three or four years four or five different versions of a remote control lawnmower, which I use to cut my lawn in front and the back. Uh, I have a uh, 80 by 100 property, and uh, the house is right in the middle, so uh, I have grass in the front, I have grass in the back, and the remote control lawnmower that I use is a push mower. Uh, I've used MTD, I've used the uh, Husqvarna, and uh, I've used Sears. Uh, I'm using right now a Husqvarna mower, and it seems to be working out pretty well. Uh, what this video is about is not so much the mower, uh, but about the bracket and the electronics and the motors that I have installed into the bracket that I've come up with in order to make my remote control lawnmower. Now, I have just started building these brackets for other people who don't want to get involved in the actual mechanics of the building of the bracket, but would rather just have the bracket sent to them so that they could install it on their standard off-the-shelf push mower. And so that's where we stand now with the, uh, the, uh, the remote control lawnmower bracket that I'm about to present to you. We, we take that bracket and we give it to someone who just wants to take it and install it with four screws onto his own push mower that he's bought, his off-the-shelf push mower. And uh, let me just show you the bracket first, and then I will show you the bracket on the uh, mower itself. So by moving my camera here, and let me just take my iPhone and my camera, I can show you, this is the bracket. Okay, the front, uh, the front end of this is where the battery, the two batteries, the two 12 volt batteries wired for 24 volts will go. Okay, and then uh, this housing here is where the electronics will go. Okay, and these two pieces here, these two aluminum pieces are for the housing, or they are the housing for the uh, motors, the inline wheelchair motors and 10 inch wheels that you will use. Okay, and they're all supported by an L-shaped bracket here, okay, and two L-shaped brackets, one on either side for the uh, support of the battery uh, housing and the electronics housing, and that's basically it. So when you assemble this unit, you would assemble this side to one end of the robot, uh, one end of the uh, mower, and then the other side would also be assembled to the other side of the mower with just four screws. And that's basically all there is. Now when we, give you, when we get, give you the bracket, you're going to get with the bracket the electronics, the wiring electronics for your receiver, okay, and your motor control board. So you'll get all of that, and we'll also fuse it up for you, so you won't have to worry about blowing your motor control board, and all of the holes that you'll need to run your wires from the um, from the uh, uh, motors to the uh, motor control board, so you'll get all of that. And basically, we can even hold your hand in, in building that part of the the robot uh, mower that you're going to be building. Uh, we can help you with wiring and that kind of thing. That'll be just a courtesy of ours, and you'll be able to make this thing up and be able to use a hobby remote control to run your, uh, to run your remote control mower from your lawn chair, if you like. So that's basically it, okay? And uh, I'm going to show you the mower now with the electronic housing. If you look down here, you can see now this is the mower. Let me just get my phone so I can, I can just show you. Here is the mower, the Husqvarna mower that I'm using. I've taken off all of the back wheels and all of the uh, doohickeys and the handle and everything else off. And um, you can see now how this integrates into the mower with just two screws on either side, this side, and also that side. So the bracket is firmly in place, okay, and it, and it has its inline motors, okay, which are uh, here along with the 10-inch wheels. All right, and you're just ready to go, and the electronics is installed, 
Let me just show you the electronics if I can. They're installed here. Oh, let me bend down a little bit here. And you can see how the electronics is installed. That's a motor control board. You're fused. You got an on-off switch for that. There is one more on-off switch for safety purposes that is on the mower itself. We're going to include that switch um, absolutely as part of your purchase price. And of course, here's your housing holding the batteries that are two 12 volt batteries wired for 24 volts. And with this, you should get two cuts front and back of an 80 by 100 property. Thank you very much. And uh, my name is Frank Paris. And uh, I hope you call us at 516-924-1178. If you're interested in one of these guys, we can send the bracket out to you within two weeks of ordering. The bracket is $500. And that includes all the help you'll need in assembling and building your own remote control uh, lawnmower. Thank you very much.